Okay, everybody, we are here with a Black Friday pickups. But before we get into that, let me point out a couple of things. First, it's raining, and if you've come out to any of our streams, you guys know uh, these cars are loud on wet roads or just loud in general. And if you haven't come out to one of our streams, then come out to our streams because we're playing through a lot of fun games right now. And tomorrow, as long as I get this video up today, we are having a follower initiative stream where any follows between now and the stream tomorrow will give Jessica cheats to try to stop me from speedrunning Super Mario Odyssey. Like Ooh. making me redo a moon I've already got or killing Mario or something to that effect. Also, one of my dogs is trying to get comfortable in his cage. Um, but without further ado, I know it's been a while since Black Friday. But I just finished up my college semester. Ooh, you can see my fingers. And, uh, and I'm like, alright, let's record this. Let's get this out of the way. So up first, this was a early Christmas present from Jessica because... Uh, the Switch Joy-Cons, at least mine, were terrible, and uh, I couldn't play Mario Odyssey, so uh, we, we kind of needed this for the stream tomorrow, so thank you, Jessica. On top of that, Collection of Mana, as you may know, was half off during Black Friday. I thought this was the 3D remake of Trials of Mana. Turns out that's coming out next year, I think, but either way, um, it's been fun. I've been playing through Final Fantasy Adventures, is what it's called. Um, pretty fun. So now for these games, uh, we at, after going to GameStop and finding it, we just couldn't ever agree on what we wanted to get as a part of the buy two get one free or buy one get one free. So we went over to a store called McKay's. It's a used bookstore that has discounted video games. So as you can see, a dollar. Hard to pass it up. Thank you, Evie. What are you doing? Pac-Man World 3. I have Pac-Man World 2 on the GameCube. Also, I'm not going to be doing gameplay footage. It's your world. Eat it. I'm not going to be doing gameplay footage for this one because I did gameplay footage for the last video and it ended up being like a 30 minute long video. Ape Escape 2. So they're pretty good about manuals, especially if you buy like PS3 or Xbox 360 games. They're pretty good about having the manual and the actual game art. And uh, this one is Mario Tennis Ultra Smash. It was a part of GameStop's buy one, get one free. So what you don't see is the other game I bought, which is Jessica's Christmas present. Mario Tennis Ultra Smash. And last but not least from McKay's was Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Winter Games 2014. So we are going for a complete Wii U collection. And uh, we decided to snag this. That is it for our Black Friday pickups. As you guys can see, we got these other packages because GameStop had a random retro flash sale. Buy two, get one free, and all the games were 16% off. So Jessica and I each got three, pack or three games inside these packages. So it's six games. For the cost of like two games. Maybe three games at the end of the day. So yeah, I just wanted to try a, a faster presentation for these pickup videos. Because I do want to do more pickup styles. I don't really have a way of recording PS2 games. But if you guys want to see gameplay footage of the Switch or Wii U games, you can let me know. Um, we are going to go ahead and record the GameStop pickup as well. So there won't be any gameplay footage with that one either. But... Um, that's it. If you want to see gameplay footage from on, let me know. But last time, like I said, it ended up making the video 30 minutes long. So what I'll probably end up doing if I do gameplay footage is have the footage over the video when I'm playing. That seems to make more sense. What I did in the last video, and you can go watch it, is I unboxed everything, showed whether it had a manual or a case, and then we had a, like a separate second portion where we tested the game to talk about whether it was working or not. But... Okay, uh, that's going to do it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let us know what you got for Black Friday. I think GameStop had some great sales. I looked online at other places for retro games. I didn't see anywhere that had near as comparable prices. Um, like DK Oldies or JJ Games or Lukey Games, I think. Their prices were still ridiculous. E-Star Land, I mean, it was like Madden was on sale from $20 down to 5 I was like, okay, no thank you. But GameStop actually had some good... Black Fridays. And then McKay's, like I said, just already has discounted video games. But, alright, that's going to do it. Hope you guys enjoyed this, and have a great day.